I'm Ulysses Valadez, and this is Braid's Cast. John Lennon's Imagine is described by Rolling Stone as Lennon's greatest musical gift to the world. Lennon composed Imagine one morning in early 1971 on a Stainway piano in a bedroom at his estate in England. Oh no, his wife watched as he composed the melody, chord structure, and almost all the lyrics, nearly completing the song in one brief writing session. The song is in the key of C major, with a length of 3 minutes and 3 seconds, and a time signature of 4x4. Four four. The song's tempo falls around 75 beats per minute. Lennon later said the composition should be credited as a Lennon and Uno song. A lot of it, the lyric and the concept, came from Yoko, but in those days I was a bit more selfish, a bit more macho, and I sort of admitted her contribution, but it was right out of grapefruit. When asked about the song's meaning during a December 1980 interview with David Shelf for Playboy magazine, Lennon told Shelf that Deck Gregory had given Ono and him a Christian prayer book which inspired him the concept behind Imagine. Imagine is John Lennon's best-selling single of his career. Its lyrics encourage the listener to imagine a world at peace without the barriers of borders or the divisions of religion and nationality, and to consider the possibility that the focus of humanity should be living a life unattached to material possessions. Lennon stated, Imagine, which says, Imagine that there was no religion, no more country, no more politics, is virtually the Communist Manifesto, even though I'm not particularly a communist and I do not belong to any movement. Ono would describe the lyrical statement of Imagine as just what John believed, that we are all one country, one world, one people. BMI named Imagine one of the 100 most performed songs of the 20th century. The song ranked number 30 on the Recording Industry Association of America's list of the 365 songs of the century, bearing the most historic significance. It was released in 1975 to promote a compilation LP, and it reached number 6 in the chart that year. The song has since sold more than 1.6 million copies in the UK. It reached number 1 following Lennon's murder in December 1989. I'm Ulysses Valadez and this was Braves Cast.